Public health officials in the Transylvanian city of Cluj welcomed a delegation from the World Health Organization this morning. It comes in response to an outbreak of a strange illness within the local student population, which first emerged over two weeks ago. The initial response of the Romanian authorities was that the debilitating illness was a mutation of the COVID-19 coronavirus, with initial clinical symptoms not dissimilar from those associated with the current pandemic. However, the fact that this illness was predominantly afflicting young, healthy adults was considered a significant departure from COVID-19, and the services of the WHO were requested. Romanian health officials are particularly puzzled as to where this virus originates. Specialists from the US and Canada who were consulted early in this outbreak have commented on the uniform nature of the new cell structure of the pathogen, with one virologist claiming that it resembled a laboratory-perfect specimen. A report today in the Times of London suggests that the current details of the illness are hauntingly similar to a case in Japan in the late 1990s, when a number of schools in the Okinawa region had to be closed due to the outbreak of an unidentified illness, which eventually killed over 17 students and infected another 300. Although the source of the Japanese event was never properly identified, rumors remain that the illness was a man-made strain of plague created by a cult similar to Om Shin Rikyo. Given the many uncertainties surrounding the illness in Cluj, WHO sources in Geneva yesterday were unwilling to speculate as to the cause of the Transylvanian outbreak. They did not discount the possibility that it was indeed a mutation of the original COVID-19 virus, although they re-emphasized that at this stage it is too early to say. WHO sources also refused to comment on the report from the Times of London, not only the similarities with the Japanese historical case, but also on the speculation that somebody in Romania could possibly be testing a new bioweapon.